In this video I'm going to show you how to do the chimney on that side elevation, on the right side elevation. So I've already got my front or side elevation drawn, I've got my doors and windows in place, I've got the overall shape. What I need to do is project the size of this chimney. So I'm going to go into my construction line command and I'm going to type in V for vertical and let's just snap to the edges, the outer edges of this chimney projects it straight down for me. So this is how wide my chimney is going to be. And the next thing that I want to do is go ahead and draw a line. So if we look at the sketch, we know that this chimney is actually, it initially is two feet up and then the chimney cap is one foot four inches. And we've actually got a block for that. So I'm just going to take this line and I'm going to offset it two feet up. And let's go ahead and trim everything out so we don't get confused here. I don't need that line anymore. I'm going to trim all of these lines out. I'll actually trim with this as the base point, or as the cutting plane, I'm sorry. So there's my, there's my roof, or the chimney itself. Now what I'm going to do is come into the Insert tab, go to the Design Center, and let's go find the cabin symbols drawing, open up blocks and find that chimney cap, and we'll bring it in. We're just going to set it right on top here. Now let's go ahead and put in the trim that we need here. So it says it's a 1 by 6 trim at the top, so we'll just, we'll keep it at the nominal size. We'll just do an offset of 6 inches. You could also make this 5 and a half inches if you wanted to. So we've got this here, and then the rest of the house has a 1 by 4 trim at the corners, so we're just going to offset 4 inches from here to here, and then here to here, and let's just trim out that 4 inch trim over here, and we'll go ahead and extend this straight down, and then trim that guy right there. And if you notice in the book, it does have a little bit of an offset. So uh, up at the top at the six inch trim. So if we'll just offset one inch over. And actually I'm going to do that fill it with a radius of zero command that we did earlier. Fill it, radius of zero, M for multiple. It's just a nice and easy way to clean this up a little bit. Here to here. You could do the trim and extend command if you wanted to. And then I'll just trim out this guy right here. And that's it. I've got my fireplace, the chimney, taken care of.